Hi Libra and welcome to your weekly tarot scope. I'm Katie, I'm a professional intuitive tarot card reader. If you are interested in a private reading with me, then you can visit my website, which is katietarot.com. This reading is for September 25th through to the 1st of October. So let's get started Libra and see what energies that want to come through for you this week. Now remember to check out your sun, moon and rising sign so you're able to get the best overview of the energies coming into, into your life this week. Libra, let's see what's happening. Oh, lots of energy, Libra. Lots of energy happening here. Got a lot going on. Hmm. Okay, let's have a look at Monday and Tuesday energy first. And we have temperance. Okay, so beautiful blending. If you're in a relationship at the moment, then things are going really well and you're really complementing each other very well. If you're in a work situation, it's going quite well. You know, you're good at your job. You're good at what you do. And other people can see that. And it's just a really good blend of energies here that I'm feeling for you this week. I feel that some people are going to be looking up to you as well, especially in a work situation or in an environment where um, you have friends or, you know, um, colleagues around you or friends or something like that. I feel that they're going to be looking to you for advice or coming to you to help with their problems. I do feel that that's going to happen this week for you. And we've got the four of swords. Yeah, you're going to be like a... Um, a sounding board for people okay so you're going to want to help them and um, they're going to come to you because of this close bond that you have and you're going to help them integrate um, their own feelings about a situation person or whatever it is you're going to help them with that and that's where this lovely temperance energy comes in I feel you might already be helping people or helping a person in particular um, in your life at the moment helping them through some difficult times and I feel that you're really giving this is um, a relationship of of giving there is uh, communication going on here and a beautiful harmony and you're just really trying to help them and lift them up maybe in a spiritual way as well you could be giving counseling in regard to spiritual matters um, they might be of a, I feel that for some of you they're going to be on a, a slightly lower vibration their consciousness isn't as awake as yours at the moment and that's what you're helping them with as well so that could be how it is for some of you um, but generally Monday and Tuesday energy is coming in here you'll have this interaction with someone close to you if it's not a spiritual thing or anything that I've mentioned and I'm also feeling that it's if it's in a work environment for you then you'll be uh, collaborating on a project or it's you and something else that you have to blend with so you and something else doesn't have to be a person but a situation or something where you are uh, going to them or, or the situation is coming to you or you find yourself in this situation um, that is quite complementary uh, towards um, this area of your life. Okay, so guys, this is a general reading. So you have to remember to place this energy in your life where you uh, where you feel it. Okay, I'm just bringing the energies through for you so you're aware of this um, these energies and vibrations in your life for this week. So there is a sense here of um, communication and helping. Okay, Monday and Tuesday for you. Wednesday and Thursday energies we've got the Queen of Swords yeah more communication going on here I'm feeling like um, this is uh, to do with the person that you're dealing with for most of you um, otherwise it's a situation or circumstance where you are really clear you're thinking very clearly about where you're headed where you want to go and if you haven't if you've been more muddled in the past then that's going to start to clear up Wednesday and Thursday for you um, your direction because I feel you're going to have a lot of uh, direction moving forward um, in this area of your life I feel that you're going to cut out some people or situation or there's a there's an energy coming in of um, letting go of those things that no longer serve you so then you're able to move forward so whatever that is for you so comments uh, below let me know what that is for you if you'd like we've got the six of cups so it is someone from the past situation or um, circumstance that you find yourself in again that you realize okay I need to break free of this I need to not be in this situation again I need to 
not um, put myself in this scenario again because it doesn't serve me and you're going to realize that this week and that energy you're going to find yourself um, involved in that person in communication or in that situation midweek okay it's good it's a midweek energy for you and looking at Friday uh, into the weekend so Saturday and Sunday we've got the seven of cups yeah, you're feeling like nothing's going to be hidden from you anymore. This is you. You don't want to have any um, any kind of illusions or boundaries or um, delusions or tricks put on you anymore from anybody else around you or in this circumstance in your life. You, you want it to be clear. You want to have a clear mind where you're going, where you're headed. And I feel this is where the Queen of Swords energy is going to follow through to the weekend for you very much a clear mind about your situation or whatever's going on in this area and you need to have that because moving forward that's how you're going to progress okay um, and have this beautiful blend of energies and become more um, able to uh, integrate your past and past hurts into uh, a heal really that's what it is heal and and not have any of those people or circumstances around you as much as you can anymore and that's really what's going to happen um the energy is coming in on the weekend for you and we've got the eight of swords yeah you're lifting up you don't want this burden anymore you don't want to feel trapped in also by your own thinking you have to remember because we've got some swords energy here that some of you are thinking um more negative about yourself you could be um having some negative self um self-worth or um you know our own thoughts getting into your own thoughts and thinking that you're not worthy of someone or something or some situation that's not the truth of it that's just how you're feeling and that's how just how you're thinking about it so i feel that that's going to be lifted up off you because you might come into some information or some knowledge about this situational person midweek here with the queen of swords energy coming through with the six of cups something to do with the past um and communication coming your way so this illusion delusion these things are lifting up and off you so then you're able to have a clearer mind about things because i feel that um in this area of your life you have been um having some negative self thoughts you know um, because of whatever's happened or um things that have happened in the past or the people around you might be uh causing this for you as well so that's going to be um, coming to the fore on the on the weekend for you you're going to be able to release that and move forward that's really what this the energy is coming in it's a really um, positive energy for that for releasing and letting go and I'm um, cutting people out of your life if you if you can if it, you know or situations or even just recognizing it on a thought level at the moment that that's what you want um, that you want this change and you need this change and uh, you're going to start to formulate a plan moving forward of how you're going to how's that how is that going to come about for you that's what you're thinking because I feel you really do want this harmony um, that's coming in here with this temperance you know whatever area of life this is for you it's um, for the longer term okay so it's been coming in for a few weeks or months and it's going to continue on for the next couple of weeks or months it's not a short-term thing so you've been working through this and you know you have a fair idea I feel there has been confusion and hurts in the past um, that's going to be highlighted midweek for you however it is going to move forward from here and you are going to especially on the weekend Friday energy as well you're going to have this lifting up of the veil really and seeing things more clearly than what you have in the past let's have a look at the advice card for you this week and we have the hermit yeah that is lifting and getting the knowledge lifting that veil and getting the knowledge that you need to move forward in this situation really clearing out old clutters from the past and hurts and things and dealing with people um, or situations that you need to that's really um, prominent um, energy coming through for this week for you so you, then you can integrate become whole and healing um, healing energy for you as well 
So that is the reading for the week, guys. Um, Look, most important thing, message this week is just recognize that if you need to take some time out to contemplate this situation, then do that because we've got the four of swords here in the hermit. So it's also speaking to um, taking some time by yourself to really contemplate and get to, um, to the crux of what's going on and how you want to move forward. What do you really want to do? How do you really want to move forward in this area of your life? You need to clarify that. Midweek, that's going. I feel that for most of you, you're going to kind of feel like you need that already and you're aware of that, but it's really going to come to a head midweek for you. And then this. Um, this energy will be lifting and a, and a clearer sky will come about and you'll be able to see further into the future and the horizon for yourself much more clearly um, by the weekend. So things will get, things are starting to get moving and, you know, I think, I think and I feel for you guys, it's an internal thing more than anything as well, just at this point anyway, uh, before it can move forward in a physical way and in a manifested way. So if you like the reading, then please subscribe to my channel. Until next time though, bye for now.